just because my salary increased uh, the behavior of spending did not increase the story that i'm narrating i i may be representing 90 plus percent of the india to cover myself up i said oh my fd kar dunga and he laughed at me and he said kya fd karoge aap a constant thing to him was dekh mere 100 rupees ka na 99 nahi hona chahiye your money has to travel in a certain way and money can buy happiness bro right <laughs> <laughs> they're actually completely taking away the personal aspect of money you say personal finance and you're giving everybody same template how at that time i had zero financial literacy i only knew salary comes you spend Welcome to this series of discussions by One Finance where we've identified eight specific money signs for different types of people. We've realized that people think about money differently. There's a lot of genetic insight that goes into people's behavior about money. And of course their environment also shapes it, their decisions, how they think about their incomes, their various income sources. what do they think about building assets investments what do they think about their liabilities which is why through these discussions we attempt to actually personify these money signs and have eight different guests with us all of whom actually represent a different money sign altogether and today we have with us a very popular figure mr manish pande hi manish welcome uh, to the show thank you sarthak thank you so much i don't know popular or not and uh, putting mr before my name makes me feel old but that's okay we're talking about money let's get some seriousness how did you experience money while growing up in your early years because that really defines how you experience money all through your life and it's very difficult to change it later yeah and there's a lot of science which has gone behind it so starting from there we'd we'd want to learn how did you grow up where did you grow up how did you experience money was there dearth of it or was there excess of it over to you so uh well uh that's a very uh, psychologically daunting question for me when you talk about money because uh i have had a, a very fearful relationship with money uh straight coming to the point uh there was no money at all when i was growing up uh i was born in a very poor family if you can say that uh my father did not really have anything on him uh my mother was dependent on my father and it it panned out to be like that that my after i was born and i was 2 year old uh, the situation was uh, my father was not able to take care of me and my nana whose maternal grandfather uh took charge and said that i should be brought back to nepal where you know my nana was from nepal and i grew up in nepal and i came to nepal at age of i was i was 2 and 1/2 and when i realized uh, at the age of 11 is what i made my first money uh the reason why i made th- that money and i specifically remember first i made 60 rupees then i made 120 rupees what was your thought process behind the loan do you think debt is something that you look at negatively does that evoke fear or do you think it's okay some amount of debt is okay to create an asset because the asset grows in value and it will automatically repay the debt so debt is good so i am very scared of debt because okay. uh, it brings back very very uh, gruesome bad memory uh, because i've seen my father uh, getting uh, you know uh, told things and uh, uh, really spoken bad words for 50 rupees 100 rupees 500 rupees ration wale ka udhar so very scared of debt when i went to buy that house uh the amount that the entire house costed registration paper work whatever i had that money with me and i'm like ye paise lo mera ghar de do but then i was advised by one of our uh, uh, you know father's friend later my father uh, you know was a security guard in icici bank so uh so i think uh, one of his managers advised me that this is not the right way of taking and he gave some financial advice and he said uh, ye loan le lo ye safe hota hai to tumhare paas jo paise hain wo usko ek account mein dal do aur usme se tumhara paisa katta rahega lekin is format lo me lo taki tumhara thoda portfolio bane thoda tax 
का वो हो दैट इज हाउ एक्सप्लेन इट टू मी एंड दस आई सेड यस टू दैट अदरवाइज आई हैड आई एम लाइक ये पैसे लो और मेरा घर दो आई वॉज विद दैट माइंड सेट बट या दैट इज दैट इज दंसर टू योर क्वेश्चन ओके सो द डे द ई एम आई स्टॉप गेटिंग डिडक्टेड डिड यू डिड यू सेलिब्रेट और डिड यू थिंक नाउ वे विल दिस मनी गो शुड आई शुड आई बी इन्वेस्टिंग इट समेर और how how did the thought of investments really come about because now what you've told us in the past 2 3 years with god's grace you've reached a point where you can afford everything that you can literally yeah. want to yeah how has now the relationship changed so i was educated to start with my uh, colleagues and friends only um, i remember uh, uh, one one of my colleague was very junior to me uh, uh, said ki pandey sir what do you do with your money and i'm like account mein hai kitna hai and i said 7 lakh rupees and it's like 7 lakh rupees ka kya ho raha hai and then to cover myself up i said oh my fd kar dunga and he laughed at me and he said kya fd karoge aap then he is the one who uh, you know uh, opened helped me open my dmat account and i did that uh, uh, you know one of the online sirodha thing and then he taught me about things and like ye stocks aise hote hain isko aise kharidte hain isme lagao एंड माई कॉन्स्टेंट थिंग टू हिम वॉज देख मेरे सौ रुपये का ना निन्यानवे नहीं होना चाहिए एक सौ दस नहीं होगा चलेगा तो तू देख ले एंड देन देन आई गॉट एजुकेटेड देन आई यू नो बिकॉज आई वॉज आई आई वर्क विद कॉन्टेंट क्रिएटर्स सो आई वॉज ऑल्सो वर्किंग विद फ्यू फाइनेंस कॉन्टेंट क्रिएटर दो पीपल देन यू नो देन दे टॉट मी समथिंग समथिंग आई डिड माई फेयर शेयर ऑफ मिस्टेक्स आई वॉज मिस सोल्ड अप लेटर आई अंडरस्टूड दैट आई हैव बिन मिस सोल्ड only when i met people at one finance only when i <laughs> you know i got an opportunity to meet uh, kevel and jeet uh, the co-founders of one finance and when i st- underst- started understanding that okay what money is and things like that and uh, you know um, then they were developing this money sign thing it was all alien to me all uh, and super complex stuff but then later i understood stuff <laughs> and and then now i understand that okay uh your money has to travel in a certain way and has to be parked in certain places for some things for uh short term something for long term kind of a situation um so now i think i have i i wouldn't say i have a lot of knowledge but fair bit of knowledge of how money should go here and there and now it gets invested uh, okay yeah so so uh to uh, i mean to bluntly answer your question uh 60% of what i make gets invested now रीजन मेरे खर्चे नहीं है hmm. मतलब उतने ज्यादा खर्चे नहीं है सो बिकॉज आई आई डोंट हैव एनी लोन ऑन मी आई डोंट हैव क्रेडिट कार्ड आई एम वेरी स्केर्ड ऑफ एनी काइंड ऑफ डेट दस दस आई डोंट हैव अ क्रेडिट कार्ड मेरे को ना डर लगता है सो मेनी पीपल ट्राइड एक्सप्लेनिंग इट टू मी कि ये बेनिफिट मिलता है पॉइंट्स मिलते हैं लाउंज एक्सेस होता है मेरे को नहीं चाहिए मतलब आई एम आई एम लाइक दैट एंड आई आई डोंट थिंक आई वॉन्ट टू चेंज दैट अबाउट मी एंड I don't care if it brings status or whatever. I'm I I'm not a status driven person. I don't chase vanity. So so I'm like मेरे को ना किसी टाइप का भी कर्ज नहीं चाहिए किसी का भी एक रुपया मेरे पे उधार नहीं होना चाहिए मैं शायद कल कंपनी भी बनाऊंगा तो मैं बूट स्ट्रैप ही करूंगा मेरे से फंड रेज करना वगैरह नहीं हो पाएगा You know one very interesting thing that you mentioned yeah. is my money from 100 I don't care if it gets to 110 10. 10. but it shouldn't get to 99. 99 yeah. I don't know does my money sign explain that uh, you think yes, what you tell it me it does it does <laughs> it does scientifically financial education yeah and most people these days get financially educated on social media oh I most, even the oh my god so so education it. is so is 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 so unfounded is so not personal despite calling it personal finance yeah. because when someone tells you that you know instead of buying a house you should put it in mutual funds or stocks and let it grow for 20 years and rent it and and rent instead they're actually completely taking away the personal aspect of money where money should first be used for for mental peace and and it's different for everyone i mean of course i can totally imagine you know putting it in an index fund or in stocks has never been your priority because for you money is first to buy dignity dignity yeah. and invest dignity. in dignity yeah yeah so uh, you know i used to buy in that concept of oh nahi rent karo because har saal aap naye ghar mein reh sakte ho चीजें चेंज हो जाएगी आई यूज टू मतलब मेरे को वो लगता था कि नहीं क्या ज्ञान है भाई ये यही है सत्य है मतलब ये सही बोल रहा है एंड आई ऑल्सो यूज टू कम बैक विद माइंड सेट कि हाँ यार वाई वुड आई वॉन्ट टू ओन अ हाउस एंड टाई माई सेल्फ टू इट आई एम अ फ्री बर्ड 
right? But then when 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 I see my mother and my sister living in the house in Silvasa, I personally I don't own a house for myself because you know sometimes I'm in some city, sometimes I'm in some city city. Uh, so so I I rent I rent even rent and I think I will rent for a longer period of time. But getting that house for my parents, my sister, I think was very important. So interestingly, at uh, One Finance, when we were doing this detailed study in. in this study has been happening for over the past 10 years now by the founders. They realize that when you ask people questions about where they invest money or what do they do with their money, a lot of times the answers come with a lot of bias. Mm. You know, they feel, as you mentioned in your story, that because when a colleague asked you, what are you doing with the 7 lakh? To kind of save some kind of embarrassment, you said, I'll put it in a fixed deposit. Yeah. And which is why today what happens is that when you ask people, what do you do with your money? Even though they may not be doing that, but they'll actually say, oh, I'll, I'll put it in stocks only so that they don't want to be judged in correct. society. And, correct. you know, they want to give answers which are considered to be cookie cutter correct as per some financial knowledge which is going right. about in society right now, which is not personal to them. Yeah. And just to kind of solve this problem, what one finance thought was it, it delved deeper into this psychometric analysis it's it's called the big five test yeah. or the ocean test yeah. which asks you certain questions um, which are not direct you know and when you answer those questions we can get an assessment of what kind of person you are yeah and then we map it to the behavior of an animal in animal kingdom and this mapping of your personality with an animal is not arbitrary. It's, yeah. it's not like we want to call you a tiger because we think you'll feel good when we call you a tiger. It's because we, we read about Darwin's theory of evolution. Yeah. We studied you know, how much of a genetic map or, or match is there between a, per, a certain personality type and that particular animal. And then after mapping that, we, we identified that there are eight types of personalities and how they think about money and eight types of animals whose behavior in the wild is very similar to these, you know, personalities. To these personalities. Yeah. And we have the results for your test which we had put you through and it turns out you are a far-sighted eagle. I and like the eagle part. Yeah. Far-sighted, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> No, so uh, I think very interestingly of whatever you told us about your yes. story, it, it seems to match uh, very well with the description I have of a farsighted eagle's characteristics. It says that there is a lot of bold decision making by this particular, uh, you know, personality Person type, which we can see, of course, all through your uh, story. The, the weakness, one part of the weakness, it says that there may be a lot of hyperactivity. You know, there may be a lot of things happening at the same time and you're trying to... It's so true, man. ...manage them. Yeah. 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 And in terms of likely financial habits, it says that, you know, you, you really want to have a long-term view, but you may have an unbalanced portfolio, which is why you may need professional assistance. And as you mentioned, you know, this one gentleman who probably told you and he guided you and educated you that you should probably take a home loan and it may come with some kind yeah. of tax benefits. So for a personality like you, it's always beneficial to keep going to professionals just to seek the right kind of advice so that you make the right decisions. Yeah. Yeah. So I think with with a much more detailed report that we will be sending you now, you'll, you'll be able to get better insights on your personality and what you should really be doing with your money and what you should yeah. not. So I downloaded this One Finance app yeah. uh, on my phone, and I uh, took that test. Yeah. And 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 uh, I was also advised. I think the app advises that the test is to, to be taken in a certain, uh, you know, you have a time limitation to it. And the questions were not easy. They were uh, really like it. It asked you to look into your soul and answer those, and you have to be honest, right? It is Correct. to be. You cannot lie to it. And uh, I th I I think that's how that far sighted eagle came out. And. Uh, you know, when the result came out, I did not read the description. I did not read uh, what are my super qualities. I read, read what are my shortcomings. And I read overconfident. And I read uh, hypersensitivity and all of that. And one more thing I'm forgetting. Uh, and I told it to myself like, yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> yes, I am sometimes overconfident about things. And that also comes from daring. Uh, you know, Correct. that uh, in my life, I had to dare always. 
and that somewhere made me over confident you know sometimes i'm like yeah main kar lunga right so and and uh, now i think sometimes uh, very i'm very lucky to be surrounded by uh, some friends now who say that thoda ruk ye matlab <laughs> it's it's okay we will do it but yeah not not the way you are do- saying it um so yeah it uh, it does work uh i'm very very thankful that uh, you know in this world where everybody is trying to sell something one finance as a company thought of designing something and calling it truly personal right when you say personal finance what i heard what i uh, you know what i used to think or what you see on internet narrative you say personal finance and you're giving everybody same template how yeah. don't buy house don't put it in fd uh don't do this don't do that i'm like no uh, it has to be tailor made for everybody it's like blood report uh, uh calcium level hum dono mein kam ho sakta hai but aapka jo calcium level kam hai aur mera jo calcium level kam hai aapke jo food habit hai mere jo food habit hai uske hisab se supplement prescribe hoga ya dawai prescribe hoga ya dietary changes honge right so why not the same in finance correct and i'm in love with one finance and and whatever uh, that thing is doing अगेन वही जो आदत है ना मैं बार बार वो ऐप खोल के देखता हूँ अभी भी और फिर से पढ़ता हूँ एंड देन वेन आई एम इन्वेस्टिंग और आई हैव अ फ्रेंड हु नाउ हेल्प्स मी इन्वेस्ट मनी स्टूडेंट शुड आई कॉल हर अ फ्रेंड नो शी द प्रोफेशनल आई पे हर अ फी सो शी शी काइंड ऑफ एंड आई हैल्सो एजुकेटेड हर ये पढ़ ले इसके साथ होना चाहिए मेरा एंड दैट इज हाउ थिंग्स आर डन नाउ डेज या सो सो वट आई एम ऑल्सो हियरिंग इज यूरो फॉर for a far sighted eagle yeah it's mostly said that it's really important for far sighted eagles to always have visibility of their money yeah. so you know it could be parked in whatever asset but as long as they know what is happening with it and where it is parked it gives them mental peace which is really important they're not the kind of people who can put it somewhere and forget about it because it's important for them to experience it and see it not everyone really has the luxury or the access to the kind of people who will invest themselves as professionals into really understanding the other yeah. person's need yeah. what happens is most of the times they have some pre designed questionnaire in which they will try to ask you questions and very mechanically fill out answers and then profile you in your risk appetite and say you know there is a 100 minus age rule that you should invest in equities and this and that but that doesn't really work for everyone yeah and i think that's that's the problem that one finance is trying to solve by saying that Okay a lot of times even the questions which are asked are not correct yeah so how can we design something for people who doesn't have access to those professionals who understand it can get on the app answer those questions and then the app designs a plan for them and gives them guidance on where they should be investing or what they should be doing with their money so because we are surrounded by startup friends uh and these are new people who are starting up and you feel emotional about it and uh, i have done mistakes where i have said bhai tu kar main deta udhar ko paise <laughs> right <laughs> and without calculating how much risk that will bring to me i have i've given money to friends uh, to for them to start up seed fund right uh, five friends giving it together and whatever so i've been a part of those things and i know that lot of it is not coming back yeah <laughs> and and uh, yeah i was yelled at and but i said hey i got emotional about it <laughs> so everything as you mentioned you know it's it's all about self realization yes it's it's not just about money it's about you know about health yeah. it's about spirituality and yeah. i'm glad at least now we have a tool which helps us realize what we want to do with money and that comes from that overconfidence which my money science is correct uh, the far sighted eagle is overconfident correct it came from being overconfident i said are ye to ev ye to chamkega are ye to ye hoga right I became overconfident about it, and I also became overconfident about my friend's uh, quality as a startup uh, founder. Uh, but I don't have control in their life. Tomorrow, their motivation may drop. Tomorrow, they might think somewhere, some way other. Tomorrow, uh, you know, uh, based on what they decide or what happens in their personal life, uh, my money's journey will be defined, uh, which was to be calculated. So even today. you also mentioned that a bunch of your friends were investing in startups and in some uh, you know such opportunities and you jumped in and later yeah. you realized probably it wasn't for you would you say your 
your friends were misselling is that something you meant when you mentioned that you were missold a product in the past or how was that different no 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 uh, i i really want to uh, say this uh, to to everybody who is watching this is take professional help uh, do not do it because somebody came and because anybody who is coming from a particular institution will always have a target on their head uh, agenda they they will just sell that to you without knowing whether you need it or not so it is very important to actually know if you have money uh if you have money that that uh, you know you want it to grow and all then please take professional help and understand yourself first one of the ways is by taking your money sign uh and uh, and and then you know go in the journey Absolutely. Yeah. So well summarized and so well said. Yeah. And thank you Manish for being on the show. I think it was an absolute honor and pleasure to have you here. I mean, uh I think uh I am honored uh and, and the reason is so this is this is who I am in life, right? Uh I think uh, the reason why I also choose to work with Jostocks uh and uh, when I uh, started working with Jostocks uh I had to really take few risks to be there. but the reason i why jumped in again eagle sign <laughs> is because uh i wanted to be a part of an institution that could give something to young india which i did not have when i was growing up the kind of guidance that elder brother figure uh, that proper uh, uh, navigation and all of that and i think one finance is also doing the same thing right giving navigation to people with their money and so it's uh, if say if you have 100 crore rupees today by god's grace uh it doesn't matter you made it you got it from in- inheritance or or somehow it came to you um if you don't have a proper guidance that 100 crore will come to zero i mean it can come or that 100 crore can become 1000 also totally depends on and not everybody gets lucky that's right, right. so uh and i'm a big believer when i talk to my content creator friends also i always say that luck versus design and i believe in design because i designed my life out of my poverty so it was not luck alone and some parts i got lucky uh i got lucky with nice set of people i got lucky with opportunity i got lucky with not saying no to the right opportunity and working extra hard harder than anybody else could do so that i secure it um i think it's is very very required so yeah i mean i'm i'm thankful for everything thank you thank you in our discussion with manish we found out how he is a far sighted eagle we understood what are his strengths what are his weaknesses where should he really be focusing on building his financial wellness and i invite you now to discover your money sign investment in securities market are subject to market risks Read all the related documents carefully before investing.